Hakwa Revitalized Therapy, Hakwapathic Medicine, and Hakwapathy, by Ferris Alhadri, PhD, Alternative Medicine. What is the concept Hakwa? Hakwa derives from two words. Hot and aqua, from the Latin word water. Hakwit, means to make the body absorb water, oxygen, hydrogen, and energy. We coined them the feels, that is, four essential elements of life. These natural elements, which represent the non-living things, nourish every living organism cells, tissues, and organs, including the human body. They are all found in water at heated temperatures. What is the concept of aquapathy? Aquapathy, also called aquapathic medicine, and trademarked as aqua revitalized therapy, is a newly introduced system of natural therapy, based on the concept that the body is created and not invented, and represents a system, that is required to be stimulated with its essential natural fuels, to maintain its entire capacity towards functioning at its maximum impact, in the healing and prevention from all dysfunctions, that are usually the main cause towards diseases and all abnormal function of the system, in any of the physical, emotional, mental, spiritual, and social aspects of health. They represent essential body's fuels to maintain homeostasis. Aquapathy underlines revitalizing and energizing the body, back to its state of entire physical, emotional, mental, spiritual, and social aspects of health and well-being, also called PEMSS, through the implementation of Hakwa revitalized therapeutic modalities, towards individuals' inherent self-healing, self-protection, and self-maintenance process. The entire therapy requires the implementation of the entire HRTM, for different purposes and health benefits. It is one of the basic methods of revitalizing and energizing the human body, in the system of natural remedies we instigated. We asserted aquapathy as a new practice of holistic health and wellness, that involves the use of HRTM. What is the concept Hakwa Revitalize? Hakwa Revitalize, is the reinstatement of the human body to its initial state of creation, in the precise form of complete PEMSS aspects of health, through the implementation of HRTM. Any dysfunction of the human body, whether in the cells, tissues, or organs, would result in the body trying to fix it. Each of the human organs, cells, and tissues, play a vital role in trying to regulate the system back to its state of maximum performance. Hakwa Revitalized Therapy plays the most crucial role, by revitalizing and energizing the body with its essential fuels, or the four essential elements of life. Any disease falls under the physical aspect of health, and only the body requires revitalizing and energizing rather than just treatment through traditional form of treatment. Whether by allopathic medicine, such as Western or conventional medicine, or alternative medicine. As the world entered a new evolution of health, information technology advances, freedom of expression, and social media, all have reached their evolving exponentially. These have paved the path towards bringing Hakwa revitalized therapy, to become one of the most advanced evolutions in the 21st century. Since the first creation of human beings, as time passed, Humans have been involved in finding means of improving lifestyle, mostly as they became exposed to various challenges. From there, humans have been in pursuit to explore, discover, and invent, until the modern time of the Industrial Revolution, which has turned the entire world into a modern world, with the construction of steam engines, airplanes, railroads, electric lights, telegraphs, motion pictures, and etc., until the present time, where the world is experiencing evolution in all the fields of science, technology, communication, and etc., leading to an exponential growth in all fields, except for one factor. The human health in all aspects has seen a detrimental decline, as the rates of people with chronic ailments, obesity, stress, and anxieties, keep rising exponentially, irrespective of the technological advances in diagnostic equipment. The cure for diseases, including those chronic ones, and other factors, have become a huge challenge not only to the entire world population, but also on government levels, and the entire world economy. The human body is the most sensitive system, that treats any foreign materials that encounter it, or enter inside it, as foreign invaders, whether natural or unnatural. Natural materials are carefully observed and react accordingly. Whereas, any unnatural or artificial materials, including, but not limited to drugs or medicines, chemicals, and etc. are the most toxic substances and poisonous materials, that gradually damage the entire body system. So many researchers and scientists, started to revolt in finding alternative solutions to secure human beings from diseases, obesity, stress, anxiety, etc., just to name a few of them, who have been mentioned here, as they found that foreign invaders made or invented by the human being, through whatever scientific or technological means, once they are inducted into the human body, pose a threat to the human's health after certain times, more than they could benefit. 
the biggest blunders had occurred when the human body was involved in the same path of the industrial revolution that it could be a tool to manipulate fabricate or replace like a spare part of a machine this did not work and will never work like at any times past present and even future making the reason why various researchers and scientists mostly on the medical side have revolted to move away from drug dependency modern life from one side has made tremendous improvements to humans lives from one but from the other side the presence of food additives that contain toxic substances that safeguard the longevity of the food preservation radiation air and water pollution but on the other side have caused damage to humans health not just physical leading to various chronic diseases obesity etc but also emotional mental spiritual and even social the latest discovery of aqua revitalized therapy is hereby substantiated by the tenets of osteopathy in addition to the principles of holistic health and wellness in such a way that the human body with its innate ability to maintain its self-healing self-protection and self-maintenance surely needs to safeguard its body's essential fuels to keep its potential aptitude to sustain its efficiency and full influence to such a degree could a vehicle run appropriately whatever is its brand price or model if there were a deficiency in one of its essential fuels to name a few of them the engine coolant engine oil brake oil differential oil and etc the answer is simply not at all this is how the human body function as vehicles has been invented upon the functionality of the human's body not vice versa thus in the occurrence where there is any depletion of the body's essential fuels namely the four essential elements of life the entire organism of the human body would start malfunctioning gradually collapse and progressively worsen the difference between a machine such as a vehicle and the human body is that vehicles or machines rely on human-made artificial fuels and regular maintenance routines to safeguard their function appropriately whereas the human body which represents a system is not invented nor is it a human-made machine rather it is a living organism exclusively created in such a way that it solely relies on specific non-living things that are also exclusively created and not invented these represent natural fuels to be precise water oxygen hydrogen and energy nature is so fabulous for these exquisite gifts known to human beings no single human being could ever make any of them from any other sources out of nature the marvel is where we witness every single human being in the entire history of all human civilizations these bodies essential fuels are irrevocably the exclusive natural source of creation and growth passing through the fetal development process until the moment the child is born for these reasons we declared our scientific discovery on the hidden potentials of aqua revitalized therapy with its aptitude to maintain the human's pemp's health in addition nutritional foods being consumed rely on the efficacy of the human body with the body's essential fuels to enhance the function of the enzymes to break them up and transport them to produce energy for the cells and build up muscles a depletion of the body's essential fuels would lead to the foods taken turning into sludge and causing various body malfunction We have hypothesized that more than 90% of human diseases are the result of foods. For this reason, we have come up with the implantation of aqua diet therapy by reducing the amount of foods taken by volume between 50 to 70% and sometimes up to 90%, except in some rare cases, such as once or twice weekly, which we coined as fraudantes diem, from the Latin word meaning cheating day, where you can eat anything your body craves for at no specific limit or amount, according to your body's capacity. The aqua diet therapy is split into 3 different categories for various benefits as follows. Modicus aqua diet. Summa aqua diet therapy. Extremum aqua diet therapy. We coined these basic principles of holistic health, the five aspects of health, namely the physical, emotional, mental, spiritual, and social aspects of health. This principle typically applies to the four essential elements of life. To maintain impeccable body function, One should maintain all the body's essential fuels at all times. Aqua Revitalize is the official brand, registered under the United States Trademark and Patent Office, number 5764566, dated May 28, 2019. Based upon our personal hypothesis, the name disease does not exist in our concept, rather, it is a temporary body's dysfunction the moment it is depleted from one or more of its essential body's fuels. All these fields are exclusively found from aqua at the designated temperature. Thus, the human body does not require any form of treatment nor alleviated in which aqua revitalized therapy completely rejects this principle by simply understanding the biological, genetic, and psychological functions of the human body. 
We personally define a disease, in any of the PEMSS aspects, as a temporary dysfunction of the body, resulting in its inability to restructure the system back to its full functional capacity, resulting from the depletion of its body's essential fuels. In such a case, once it occurs, whether it resulted from a bacterial, or virus infection, or any foreign invaders, such as pathogens, including, but not limited to stress, anxiety, etc., the system just requires to be revitalized and energized back to its initial state, towards self-healing, self-regulation, and self-maintenance, through the implementation of the Hakwa Revitalized Therapy.